Good evening, everyone, particularly Ian Jackson, and welcome to the Thursday Night Throwdown, brought to you by the Armchair Dragoons. It is a pleasure always to be with you. We have a crew here because tonight, tonight, I, I, I don't mind admitting it, we're going back to something that we've uh, neglected just a little bit, and that is Project Catrabra. Ten ways to four arms. Look at this. Where we ground through a whole bunch of different miniature rule sets and tried to figure out which one gave us the best battle of Catrabra and which ones are best forgotten. I can certainly name those. One of the <laughs> rule sets we absolutely love here at the Armature Dragoons, of course, is La Salle 2 by Sam Mustafa. And I realized that the way that this game works best is when you give it space to breathe. So I said, why not? Why not set it up in such a way that we could play it not with 15 millimeter, not with 6 millimeter, not with 25 millimeter, but with 54 millimeter figs? That's what these are. These are in scale 54 millimeters. This table, for those, because I know you're snarky jerks and are going to measure it anyway, this table is 218 inches across. That's how much space we're dealing with here. I do need to turn the grid on because I figure everybody's going to want to use their grid measurement. So I'm going to do that rather than make sure. Oh, it is. It's a four inch grid. Look at that. So it's all set. You can set your measurement to grid then, gentlemen, if you would. Tonight we have coming in in a role he is very comfortable with. We have playing the Emperor of the French, Napoleon Bonaparte, although in this case it's really Mich Marshal Michel Ney. We have Dalinar. Good evening. Viva la France. It's been a while since we've been able to have you bust that out. That's nice to hear. I know. Over on the other side, we have the two-headed monster, because I assume they both want to play the um, allies, although I don't know. I don't know. What do you want to play, Achilles? Uh, I'm fine. Yeah, I can play allies. All right. No OJ, you, you want to play the allies too? Sure. All right, I know, yeah. you're, I know you've done that a lot. So you've got a whole lot of guys to sort through. You've got Picton's whole brigade over here. You've got the Brunswickers over here. You've got the Netherlands over here. Plus, you've got these highly elite troops that will be joining us when we talk about that in the scenario a little bit later. So a lot of guys to sort out. Dalinor, baby, it's you, just you. So Yeah, see. So uh, if you all want to grab some stuff, we're going to start out. But this is a standard... Well, it's high, It's not standard. This is the sort of game that makes Sam Mustafa cry. He gets very disappointed in us when we play games like this because he never <laughs> intended for this game to be this big. And yet we made it this big. That's okay. Um, As should you expect any less. Yeah, I know. Should you expect any, expect any less? Good evening, Red. It is good to see you as ever. Let's uh, send out a tweet. I think that's what we should do. You know, Ron, your your Viva La France, they can go with for, for Ney, whether he's got Napoleon as his emperor or Louis as his emperor. That that is correct. That's yeah, true. That is that true. Is, that is true. Has eyes on has. What was I going to ask you? Doggone it! It'll come to me. I was going to ask you a question, and I don't even remember what it was. Shoot. Anyway, uh, we're all set. We have eyes on. I've got my rule book open. I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit unplussed because I don't have the chronologist. Um, but let's go over how we do this. Let's talk about the scenario, because this is the scenario borrowed, taken from the Shaco rule book. I really do like this scenario. It's got a bigger swath of the Belgian countryside. But as I say, it's double sized. It's much bigger than that intended for Shaco. Um, however. Uh, we talk about the terrain. The small lake is impassable. The village of Jemioncourt is a fortified farm complex right down here. If the fighting gets down there, something's a weird, something weird is going on. <laughs> um, the uh, we will talk about deployments. The Allies deploy first. Deployed first. Uh, the arrival of Cook, who is off table, and I'm sure the Allies will see him there. He's supposed to arrive on turn six, on turn six, but his, his arrival will be delayed for each allied formation that breaks before he arrives. That means he's eliminated here in terms of LaSalle 2. Um, let's talk about what else you're going to get. The uh, Pierre, Pierre, he arrives on turn one, as does Jerome. 
So they're both going to arrive on turn one, Dalinar. So they get to march right on. But I've got them off board right oh, now, as they should yep. be. Kellerman is going to arrive on turn seven. Turn seven. For the Allies, um, Al Alton arrives on turn two. Alton arrives turn two. And Cook on turn six, although can be delayed. The big victory point is obviously the holding of Katra Bra. And, uh, and then breaking your foe. So it's causing casualties and holding Kachabra in this 12-turn battle. 12 turns, 12 turns. All right. So with that as our start, I suppose we ought to go right down here to the very beginning. Did you gentlemen count up your brigades? No, I know you didn't. I know you didn't. <laughs> you know, because I just know how this works. So instead, I will have to inform you as you fill out your, uh, your momentum card that the French begin with Bachelieu and Foy, which is a total of two. I count as two. The British, they actually start out with a bit more. Perponcher, Brunswick, Picton, and Merlin. So they start with four. Four momentum. Ooh, Ooh I know. Uh, both sides have their baggage, of course. I assume that you will both be using your uh, generals for... They don't have special abilities, so you'll be using him at least initially for momentum. Correct. So let's get a die roll from you both, please. 1d6 and take half of it. And that's how my night started. <laughs> <laughs> Allies, please. Is that what you were going to do? There it is. Three. Very nice, Achilles. And then finally, we're now going to... So we now have our momentum. And now we're going to go over and... Plink, plink, plink. Do this thing. This, I pre-tabulated. Because Jerome is off the board, that's what's driving it down. If we take a look over here, we will see here in the hands of Sean Connery, who always looks over the dice fountain for us. It is a competition of 63 to 78. 63 to 78, so that's an awful lot. I encourage you to roll it. Remember, you're looking for sixes. Go for it, Gillies. No D&D &D tonight. Time to get in here. What, is that Joe? That's Haz. Yeah. It's Haz. Oh, it's Haz. Oh. Yeah, Haz, you want to play? You want to play? You come in, man. Honestly, yeah, 13 the, for Ron mm -hmm. and 7 for Allies. The Allies lost by seven. 6. By 7. By 7. Six. Wow. Well, unfortunately, I don't think anybody's going to be anywhere near close enough to uh, lay a skirmy on it. Maybe it would. I don't know. Because you can't be in column. So that's, that's, the way, that's the way we know the game's going to start. The first thing we have to do, though, is deploy. We have to deploy. I'm going to turn the map on. Here it comes. Allies, have at it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, I think it would be extremely helpful, Mike, if we decide which guys we're going to have. <laughs> well, I think it divided up pretty evenly, British and, and non-British, maybe. Well, except that they're split with Perponcher on one side and Picton on the opposite. Maybe, um, no, uh, oh, is he? Oh, what well, was I thinking? Papancher, no, Papancher's not British, no, he's Dutch, yeah, that's he's right, Dutch. He's Dutch, you're right. Um, it, 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 my thinking is, you know, the British can take Merlin since that's a separate command, and then, obviously, yeah, that, as no, the that reinforcements makes sense. Come on, the British can start taking, taking the reinforcements, <clears throat> so whichever half you want, oh, okay, um. Well, then you have the Duke of Brunswick here. All right, so do you want uh, Brunswick and Perponcher, and I'll take Merlin and Picton? Sounds good. Okay. Is it me or is Achilles sounding kind of like in a hole? 
He is. He's got a little. You got a little tin can thing going on there, my friend. Oh, really? Because oh. you trade sides, I buried him. How's that? Is that better? Oh, that's a lot. There better. you go. That's a lot better. Yes. Yeah. I just had the mic, the boom of the mic, up at the top of my head instead of in front of me. Uh huh. <clears throat> okay. Already moving. <gasps> you'll you'll notice that they are not eager to be at the front of their deployment boxes. You know that, yeah. Okay. And I thought, gentlemen, that we would play with our revised LaSalle tree rules. Ye yeah, okay. Which I believe we came down to the conclusion that we were going to allow full visibility in the woods, basically. For, Only for, and, and for both charge. of them are in the for yes for charge purposes for people who are both in the woods. Yes. Can the artillery move through the woods? Mm -hmm. It's just a complication. And that's fine. I just think about where I wanted to deploy some guns. Sure. On the other hand, these Blackwatch guys are sitting there going, really? Really? Sticking us out in front of the trees. Thanks a lot for that, Achilles. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. Phrase, does the phrase bloody bagpipes mean anything at all to you? <laughs> Very little means they very little to me. <laughs> back in Brussels at the party, dancing for the Duke. Dancing, dancing for the Duke and the Duchess over their swords. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just so you know, Has and Red are taking a pool on who rolls the worst tonight. And Ron, I want you to know that Has has wagered one billion quatlus on you. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I think. Yeah. Easy for the non-participants to say. Yeah, the uh, the peanut gallery has spoken. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know. I don't know. It's a fight between me and Achilles, so I mean, eh. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> this could be a. This could be a race straight to the statistical bottom. Now you watch, it'll be Mike. <laughs> yeah, right? I don't know, Mike. Mike, that guy, for all his self-effacing quiet talk, has lately been on a dice-rolling tear, to tell you the whole truth. This is very true. That's not going to fit. What's Velcro up to tonight? He's getting shoes, because he... Uh, Gave him a choice. They said he could join a sport or they would make him do what the equivalent of freshman Phi Ed. So he said, well, you know what? I'll do uh, cross country. Huh. So he needed to go get brand new shoes. He's got the uh, lanky body for a cross country. He does. He sees it that way. And he also has a, a mother who looked at him when he suggested football like he was from Mars. <laughs> no soccer. Oh, I'm well, sure. I was going to say, what about soccer? Soccer is a cut sport where he goes, and they they have been literally national champions. Ah, ah okay. And it's it's around here. Uh, we have a sizable Latino population and a sizable uh, Eastern European population, and those people. I, I will always remember this. I took Velker to a soccer game when he was very young, uh, maybe like fifth, sixth grade, and he loved it. He enjoyed competing in it. Played it well. Uh, scored more goals than I ever did. But uh, at one point, we saw this grandpa playing with, like, his two-year-old grandson on the sidelines while we were watching a game. And what was he doing? He was kicking him a soccer ball. You know, he was... Mm. You know, it's, it's, it's in certain cultures. East, like I say, Eastern European, Central European. It's Latino. in the blood. It's It's from the cradle. That is very true. 
I, I was an assistant football coach at uh, uh, a Catholic high school mm-hmm. for a while, and, and their football program was new. Uh, American style football program was new for them. They were in their first year, but they had a they had had a soccer team that was really really good uh, for a long time, and it was one of the things that struck me was. You know, growing up as a kid, I watched football with my dad, all that kind of stuff. So you're just kind of imbued into the culture of it, and you understand things just kind of instinctively. These kids had never watched it. They they were trying to learn the game, and, you know, they were used to soccer. So getting them used to, yes, you can put your hands on the ball, but also um, the idea that, like, when, when somebody fumbled the ball, that you could go after it. <laughs> it didn't come instinctive to them. They would yeah, just yeah. stand around and look at it. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> so, you know it, was, it was really interesting. <clears throat> it's, it's it's a cultural thing. Mm-hmm. Like drinking. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah. 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 That's a global that's, thing. That's, that's what it is. <laughs> just like that. <laughs> Okay. These guys. <clears throat> um, occupation of Katarba uh, in La Salle, is that the one where if you put guys in there, they stay yes, there forever? Stuck for the game, exactly. Okay. Incoming, gentlemen. Ron, I got your partner. Destruct is coming. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I think he saw who the competition was going to be tonight, and he said, oh, I got to get in this. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't tell him I was his partner, though, right? Right. <laughs> I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling some kind of way about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling some kind of way. <laughs> okay, and they do in this one they do need to be in some kind of formation inside the town. Yeah, they do this thing they basically like a square. It's it's like a square, but they have to yeah. be within a base width of each one guy has to be within a base width of the exterior wall of the thing. You know, so they face in the four directions. Okay. It's to regulate shooting out essentially. Putting the land there is that's not a bad move really. You can show them the. I, I scaled these buildings to be exactly the size they're supposed to be, so they're as, as far as footprint goes. Hello. Hey, Hello, he Distra. Oh, 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 okay, it's working. There you go. Technology is your friend. Keep saying it. It seems that whenever you send me messages, Discord's just like, no, I don't need to tell them. <laughs> People wonder why I'm not using the Discord thing. No, I don't ever have that problem with Discord. It's just Jim. Everyone else is fine. Yeah, so I'm not right, sure what the right. problem is. That's because Jim doesn't like Discord. That's not true. That's the lie Tuna keeps telling. It it took Tuna three years to get you to go to it. And it, is then not, it was and not three years. It was not. That's a lie. That's Tuna. right. It was four years. <laughs> <laughs> you know. But notice as soon as you went to Discord, he quit playing. Yeah. He noticed that? No fooling. No fooling. <laughs> it's like, dude. That like, achieved his goal in life. I, I was say, I am done now. I <laughs> shall not leave. Yeah, he's like Prospero in the Tempest. He throws his staff into the sea and goes back to civilization. <laughs> we have a slight issue in that there are not enough colors to choose from. That's because Serrano's in the in. Am I one of the? Why, why yes. I, why was I not told this? 
Well, that's because I had blue cleared, so I went to blue. Mm. I'm out. A uh, question, Jim. Ahoy. That the re our reinforcements. Do they have? Where do they come in? Oh, yeah. <laughs> funny, you st funny you should ask. Well, not <laughs> when, but where. Yeah, no, I know, I and mean, I knew what you were asking. Yeah, <clears throat> I, I'm assuming this is uh, a variation of the one in the book. This is actually the Shaco scenario. Oh, that makes a lot more sense. Yep. This is what you get for assuming, sir. Ahoy. I know. <laughs> Your uh, Jerome comes in. in hey, Achilles, don't forget. Ah. Yeah. You get it, Merlin, over here. In this square. Oh, yes. Run <laughs> Thank <here>. you. <laughs> and half this square. Actually. Oh, this one and this one? Yep. Oh, God. Pire, oh, God. Pire comes in. Along this road in here, this the square of the road, and half the one to the left. Yep. Arrgh. So, uh, who has the unfortunate uh, luck to have me on their team? That would be the French and Eleanor. Vive la France! <laughs> Vive l'Empereur! How you want to split them up, donor? I'm gonna split the truck right down. Oh, you mean the troops? Um. Wow. <laughs> All right. <you're> right. <laughs> you know what? Take. Oops. Here we go. Ooh. Take. Take Foy. Okay. And then. And take Jerome. Jerome comes in on turn one here and here. Oh. Okay, so you're you're taking puree? Yes, because it sounds like the stuff I used to make in nursing homes. Nice. Um, do you mind if I rework some of this deployment? Or yes, I'm just waiting for them to get deployed over there. I think we're done. Oh, okay. So then, yes, we work. You see the box there that we have to deploy, you get to deploy in. Hey, Jim. Mm -hmm. Just real quick. I know here, here, and here, and here, there was some uh, unlocked river tiles. Thank you. Hey, Jim, is this guy locked? He didn't want to go. Don't make him. Yeah, you know, I was like, quit being a jerk. You can't take me. Can't take me. I'm oh, not. I think I think all the these three guys. Are they really? No, this really? one's not. But this Living one nice, is. Peaceful, peaceful lives in on our farms, and then you come back and drag us off to and war. And this guy. What the heck? Question regarding movement: Is it just the regular, or is there something special about this one, like the double? What you're going to want to do is set it to grid. Got it. S set your measurement to grid because this is a, these guys are 54 millimeter scale. Right. Okay. And so base width is for what it's worth. Base width is four inches. This is the same as that uh, club game. Got it. We're playing with Ken dolls. You are. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tempt me. Do Only not in tempt TTS. Me. Damn right. Got it. Achilles is waiting for that movie to come out. Which one? The Barbie, the Ken Barbie. movie, the Ken movie, yeah. the, the the Ken and Barbie movie. There's a Ken and Barbie movie. Yep, a live God. action, a live action. Yeah, live action. And they With Ryan Gosling is playing Ken and uh, Roby. What's uh, Margot what's Robbie? Mar Margot Robbie. Thank you. Is playing Barbie. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and Margot Robbie punched her stunt stunt uh, stuntman by accident. 
full full punch. Oh. <laughs> it was supposed to be a scene where he comes up and grabs her butt and he she turns around and punches him. Well, she didn't she didn't <laughs> she didn't hold back. <laughs> <laughs> Broke his nose. Wow. Oh man. <laughs> As I flip through all the stuff on my Amazon <laughs> Amazon Prime and think, my God, there is nothing to watch. <laughs> it just gets worse. <laughs> just put it in a watch. Depends what you want to watch. Oh, my God. Yes. Well, I have like a million channels of nothing but garbage. It's unbelievable. That's why we, my wife and I were just talking about this. About the only time the TV's on is in the evening or at lunchtime for the local news. Oh, I, my, we cut the cord five years ago. Yeah, we haven't <clears throat> that long. The thing that, that that got us to cut the cord is Discovery Plus. Because mm-hmm. in the wintertime, <laughs> my wife will watch that. So <clears throat> I don't even know why I have Hulu and Disney Plus anymore. It's like I never watch any of it. I was I was I watching that all. earlier today. <laughs> did, I, did I did I did I discuss my trauma? Did I discuss my trauma? But Velker needed. Is, is this the usual trauma or the or a new kind of trauma? This is a new. Thanks, thanks, thanks for that. This is. <laughs> this, wow, wow! You you've been here a minute, but you do get the place. Um, yeah, this is this is going with my son to get a new phone or to get a phone. He's never had one, and um, the lady at the store, as she's looking at plans and how she can add to plans, goes, hey, or. Uh, are you 55 plus? And I went, Oof. And I went, <laughs> I went, yeah. You get the senior discount? <laughs> I get the silver plan. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's, okay. that's great. The more serious question is, what did you get Velcro for a phone? iPhone. Okay. The newest one? No. You didn't start him off on like a slider phone? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, he kept... Those were cool. He, he, was, he was so afraid that that's what we were going to do. <laughs> that we were going to give him one of those because that's actually they're trying to bring that back I, that sliding thing. Well, I mean, we started both of our kids off of those, but yeah. I told you him how happy I was, I was when I got one that I, I got still, one of those I like sliding keyboard it. ones. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure it, your mom. I mean, his mom probably wanted to give him one that still had a cord attached to it. No, no, she wanted to get him the <laughs> jitterbug phone that called two numbers, hers and mine. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> wow. You're not allowed to have friends. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, and it's and we both we admittedly we, we confess our sins as parents. As he's been calling his friends to give him his contact information, we've been hearing the side conversation of your parents let you have a phone? Dude. <laughs> <sighs> oh no. Bad parent. That's therapy. Um yeah. All right. How are the French doing? Yeah, he'll talk about that for many years. Oh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not living. There. And he gets to pick my rest home. Um, you, you about actually my my wife missed her slider phone when she first went to a smartphone. Oh, my wife. My, well, my wife is frugal. I'll use that word. And um, she hung on to the very first cell phone she had for years, mm-hmm. to the point that the company said they no longer supported it. <laughs> we we had to get my wife we had to switch our plans because my wife was texting so much okay. <laughs> it was like oh my god <laughs> like how do you text so much and then i realized yeah every time you send her something she'll reply back okay uh, one thing <laughs> one thing you should know destruct is that because of the tar pit problem uh we were gonna play this over in the trees that you get full vision dis you get uh the full vision you can see each other for melee purposes only if you are oh I, okay yeah yeah if you're but you probably, can only shoot the one base with exactly exactly yeah got it i don't think i, I told you guys the, uh the second nasa line is going to be doing a lot of charging yeah no so you never know you never it's, i i don't i'm not yeah i doubt it but we'll see god there's a lot of guys out here I never noticed this until I finally see people playing with them. What are you fiddling with, Dalma? We don't ask those kinds of questions. My mind. 
Well, in fairness, you're sort of a... You watching this, Has? Hey! Oh, sorry. I didn't realize that was uh, supposed to be I, there. No, I put him there because I like him there. <laughs> <laughs> He's overlooking us. Yeah. Getting ready to fail his mission. Hey! Wow. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> Yeah, it's starting early on the... Uh, have you been initiated into the ritual of the burlap sack, Destruct? No, I don't think I have. All oh, French, boy. All French, <laughs> all French <laughs> commanders under Dalinar, along with that baton they carry in their knapsack, also <laughs> also have a velvet-lined burlap sack that uh, wow. is, is uh, in, you know, when Dalinar ain't looking. That goes that goes all the way back to the Leipzig game. So. Yeah, yeah, it does. Well, that and we won't mention the other thing. Right, right. <laughs> we, uh, what was that? We all set to go, French? Yeah. We, we. All right, let's rock it. I'm going to turn the grass on. Here we go. Pow. Turn on. Whoa, oh, the grass grew. It grew suddenly. Wow. Yeah, there it is. Wish mine would grow. And they up. said yeah, watching grass grow is boring. Yeah, well, uh, and you all missed, I, I know you missed this part to start, but you got five mo over here. Um, which uh, is going to be an interesting amount of mo once the stuff really hits the fan. But you'll get some more guys on the field too. Um, okay. Al almost immediately. So oh, that's our combined mo. Yeah. yeah, because this whole the, like it's Foy's brigade is what I'm assuming this yeah, is. Yeah, exactly. Right? Is that how we're working exactly. this? Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's a gigantic big thing, and you know what? I'm going to make a ruling just because I'm looking at this that frankly you guys need to have that extra mo for both Jerome and for Pire because they're coming on this turn. So that's going to push you to seven. Uh, yeah. And they can come on anywhere on our baseline? Or Negative. Like no. Jerome's from here to here. Okay. And Pire. my horse is... Or it's, I think it's like, what was it, this road and then like half here? It's a little further than that. It's down here. It's like that. Yeah. Right. Cool. Hey, hey Killies, join Team Spades. Yeah. Okay. Let's, let's get some Team Spades. <laughs> please, please and thank you. The um, But that does leave the French in command of the table. French, give an order. To start, go! Okay, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be marching boldly forward. Oh, uh, that's that's not a gigantic surprise. Go for it. Um, oh, really? I thought we were waiting. This is this is oh, geez, do I? Yeah, what the hell? Um, I'm gonna need to do a complication. I'm most likely gonna be in in range of the enemy. So, um, hope well, that's compli okay. Complicate it. Okay. Um. Can someone measure the four or however much I can be away from these? Hold things? on. If you're doing a complication. Not a con not a complication, an interruption. Not a con interruption, yes. Well, no, it is. I'm going into terrain, so it's a complication. Yeah, that's, <laughs> a, that's a complication, but getting close to the enemy isn't. No, no, but I'm, I mean, it's going to be interruption and a complication. Yeah, there you go. He's what doing, doing both. <laughs> so, Ron, you want to do something else? Um, unless, you don't, unless you don't want me to, in which case I won't. Let me move first, then. Okay. Because I don't think I'd be in in their range, so. No. Not for the first turn. Right, correct. If you get, what is it, eight or nine in March? No, sorry, not in March. He's not in March. He's in mass. And, and sorry, and then the, the six whatever is, it's called. Six, six is mass. Yeah. And obviously you can't enter the lake. I have little boats. I, yeah, that's, that's... <laughs> the littlest boats. <laughs> that sounds so insulting. Yeah, it does. He has wee boats. How are we are the tiny boat brigade. Yeah. How are your wee boats? <laughs> yeah, it's a whole brigade, all right. So that's two, but you can keep going. 
Yep. Now you go. Okay. So does does me my complication also count towards the? Yes. Or is it like a yeah? Okay. Right. Um. Yeah, it's interesting why the quick reference thing here mm -hmm. shows all the movement values and everything, but it does not show ranges. I know. It's amazing. It's it's one of those things that's like, Sam is so good at things. This is one of those things that makes me go, how do you not do that? Yeah, it seemed like that would be pretty basic. <clears throat> Yes, it's just Blucher, his Blucher one has the ranges. Mm -hmm. Where's four from the cavalry? Because I don't particularly want to be charged, so we're okay. Bit. These guys will be on the bridge. How's that? That seems thematic, right? Being on a bridge? I think so. That seems right. Uh, so far, okay, no. So you've got, oh, you, yeah, oh. you've got these guys in March, so they get to go a lot. I know they got to go get to go further, but I don't feel like... You don't, um, you, you don't, you're not feeling that. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is going to interrupt anyway, because I got too close to the 28th Nassau line, but that's mm -hmm. I'm whatever. All right, so that's yeah, but you got all the rest of Foy to move, yeah. which is not an insubstantial number of dudes. Is that within? I can't get that close. I have to be stop at four, and then I can move one more. Mm -hmm. So. Why not? Man, this sucker haul it's funny. This game does move quickly into contact, I'll say that. Perfect. Um I messed that up. These are actually in the um, the other thing, the other formation. Are they, in fact, in mass? Mass. Yep. They are in mass. I'll remember okay. these words someday. They in mass or having mass? Which one? Are these? <laughs> you funny. Maybe both. And and just so you know, uh, since I don't know if you spotted it, Achilles, but volley range is four base width. Four. Yeah, I assumed as much, but I was looking for it, and I couldn't find it on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Can someone measure four away from that cannon? That very spooky, scary cannon? Yes, well, I don't particularly feel like being canistered right off the bat. <laughs> it's a great way to start the day. <laughs> Keep calm and load canister. <laughs> Grape. It's a great way to start the day. And we don't do grape notes. Okay. And then I need to be within. Th so, four is there, and then one. This guy is just gonna. Um. Actually, he's probably got enough movement to just do that, doesn't he? And to my left, Foy just disappeared. Yeah. Well, yeah, he wandered into the weeds anyway. 
Now I need to just adjust that because I need that cannon to be able to deploy. Perfect. Okay. So this either works or it doesn't. <laughs> Don't forget About to, to find out. Don't forget to charge yourself the two points. I did. An interruption. Uh, that would be an interruption on the part of the allies. Coalition. Of I want to call them allies. They're coalition. not the good guys. Coalition. Coalition. The coalition of the, the young evil women. coalition of <laughs> ever. What uh, what order would the coalition like to uh, issue? Which of us is Wellington, Mike? <laughs> you are. Oh, thanks. Well, boy, it's my it's my day to get defaulted into command. Isn't yeah. It? Mm -hmm, yep. Yeah, it seems so. <laughs> yes, we will. We will interrupt. Um, With what order? Okay. Um, Von Merlin is going to change formation. Where's he hiding? Oh, there he is. He's, he's back. He's up back here. here. Got him. Mm -hmm. and... I assume the formation he's in right now is mass, right? Yep. So I want to change him into March. Mm -hmm. So I just yep. do it like this? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, formation change, remember, is a global, global order. So oh. you can do it with if, if, you, if you just grab it and hit three, it just yep. pops nicely into line. Mm -hmm. There you go. Wait, do you grab all of them? Yeah, you grab three? Yeah. So, yeah. Or, or or you can oh, grab three. Yeah, you can do it either way. If you grab three, you know the first one's where it's supposed to be. Your your um, regulating base. Also, if like you make a mistake and you're still holding them, you can press escape and they go right back to where they were. Okay. Uh, let's see. So yeah, it's since it's global, everybody can do it, right? Yep. Yep. <clears throat> you yeah. can join the party too, Mike. Yeah, I'm going to hold. I don't need to change yeah. any formations right now. Okay. Changing formation and terrain's a complication, right? Yep. Yeah, okay. I was thinking maybe we want to open up with a bombardment on these guys. Or you want well, to I'm planning to do longer. that next, but... Uh... <laughs> That's funny. I'm planning to bombard them next. All right. <laughs> But I figured that the formation change wasn't going to be an interrupt anyway, so it no. didn't matter which order I did them in. No. <clears throat> okay, and quite honestly, do you want to hang on to that one because you can volley with that one, right? No. If he gets he's, closer. He's, he's, if he gets closer, yeah. I, well, yeah, I just yeah, moved, already, so there's literally yeah. no way to do right. that. Right. Okay. That's what I was going to yeah. say. Is he's already moved, so the bombardment's our only option to hit him at least. Okay. Let's go with the uh, bombardment next, please. And you can go ahead and start us off, Mike. All right. Ooh, Mike's, um, ooh, today's Fox, gentlemen. <clears throat> nice little glass of sherry. Yeah. <laughs> I think All I'm right. going to... Going to go for my artillery? Going to... Horse artillery to the reserve artillery here. Start with... Okie dokie. Ow. So you're hitting on one better. So let me, I'm sorry, I was uh, di momentarily right. distracted. Who's shooting? Uh, Perponchi. My horse, Perponchi. My horse yep. artillery against his reserve artillery. All right. Uh, is Three that a shift up threes. or down because he's limbered? No, it's a shift up. Uh, uh, whatever is him making him hit better. He should be hitting me on three plus now. Uh, no. Oh, uh, yep, March. That's it. Yeah, it is that March. There it is. You look, look at you knowing all them rules and stuff. Even if they disadvantage you, bravely done. I literally played this this exact... Well, not this exact scenario, because it's Shaco, but the LaSalle version of it two days ago. Alright, show me this arc that doesn't hit your own guy. Ah. Don't you just place the uh, one base with... Oh, I see. Yeah. I see the problem okay. here. Well, if we don't have the angle, that's fine. Then we'll just go. You should. Does that? No, because I don't think it does. Oh, the little, the tiniest little yep. bit of your corner. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Guy... And it'll be the target will be first battalion, fourth legier. Yeah, that that because uh, that actually that that'll will, that will not bounce because he's in water. Oh, because I'm in water. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so that will not bounce. So, uh, however, <laughs> he is in column, which uh, is that same mark. Shift thing. up. So he does get the yep. shift. Uh, anyway, so he's going to roll ba -ba 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 -ba, three dice for threes. One 
One well, hit. you tried. Ah! Wow. Ah! I'm sassy today, apparently. I'm that's sorry. that's that's a thing. Holy cow! It's that that's that Bart Simpson throwing the birthday cake in the garbage. Uh, at least you. Mm. Tried. All right, and I got the fourth or the foot artillery going against the second battalion, one hundredth line. Yeah, that is not a same problem. amount of rolls, just but worse. That's affirmative, so that's three for four. I'll do. Ooh, that's better. Next. You Achilles. Okay. <clears throat> this is going to be a little rougher. Yeah. We will go this way. So it's going to hit him, him, and him. So it won't bounce past the river. So in the front, them fellers what are in the front, they get hit three for four. The heck was that? I'm just taking my artillery. So I can just one. In the back, this is three for six. Nothing. And three for six. Oh. Oh, I'm saying I'm hitting the wrong stupid button here. Okay. Hit the other <clears throat> Stupid button. There we go. Got one. Oh, I think you turned off your print. You turned off oh. your print. There yeah, you that's... But you got one? Yeah, I got one. All right. <laughs> uh, anybody else? Any other guns from the Allies? Nope, we've only got... No, the we don't have any but the Coalition mine. You're funny. Um, <laughs> all right, well, we'll go over here then and see what we can make stick. OJ, we got uh, two for four right there on the 100th. 2nd Battalion, 100th line. Stuff. Oh no! Pew. Well, someone was going to get hurt, right? <laughs> we, it's you know, kind of the nature of war. We have a <laughs> we have a stern exchange of views. Uh, one for four here on the fourth Legere. Duck it. Yeah. Like I said, this OJ creature does good. Nice. Yeah, get this out of the way. Is that it? Now I got over here uh, to got these Achilles. Over here. Achilles, one for four. Nope. nope. And one for four. Nope. Nope. Right. Oh, the British cannot shoot. <laughs> we have the amount they cannot shoot. All right, We're just got, testing the guns. You got to pay one. <laughs> trying to find your range. That's one yes. point. So that's a total of two, two. I believe, spent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. So for the volley or for the bombardment and for the formation change. Still no interruptions, though. What would you like to do now? All right. Mike, anything you want to do over there? I think we want to move my cavalry up here a little bit. All right. I think they can only go like yeah, they're gonna less get, than they're half gonna, an inch. They're gonna yeah. get. They're gonna get. You know, one inch. They, they, it, they get no. They get to move two because they're cavalry. Are you on grid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am yeah, on, grid. on. So you grid, get to move two. Get, yeah, they get. They get two base widths. So interesting. I don't need to go quite Hello. That far. Salutations. Yeah, we'll just go that far. Very good. All right, that's an interruption. Greetings. That's one point. Pay it for the interrupt. Pay for that. Now we come over here okay. and say French people. Um, so here's the thing, right? I could do a formation change and cost us two pips, or we can just use an emergency formation change next go. You could do that. That's right. What are your thoughts, Dalinar? Uh, the problem is we still got two units to bring on. <laughs> well, they're they're going to come on at the end, so that's, they're not going to be able to do anything anyway. Well, no, they come on. They we don't use the reinforcement rules. They just come on. So oh no, going. I know that, but like it's at the end of the. T it's after we're all done anyway, so we won't have any mo to do anything with them till next go. No, you will though. You could move them this turn. Right, we can oh. move. Them, like, I don't. Mow this I don't turn. use. I don't use the LaSalle reinforcement rules with this because the Shaco scenario imagines they're marching on. All this does is back them up a little bit. 
Okay, so at, at what point is this going to now show up, or can we just say that they are now, now showing up? Now. now. Yeah. Okay. So say when you, like, that's what, you know, the, the Mo. I guess we should spend a couple Mo and get them on the board then. Mm-hmm. So you're okay doing an emergency formation change at the beginning of the next turn? Yeah. Otherwise, the my poor leisure are going to be very dead. Ooh. That or I could win initiative. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, you're assuming you're going to win initiative. No. Or lose it. Or lose it. Okay. If emergency formation change doesn't matter if you win or lose initiative. It's right after it. Yeah. No, but Mike's point is you don't need to burn the emergency formation change if you think you're going to win initiative. Oh, yeah, exactly. That's what I was thinking. But it doesn't necessarily mean that's my luck. Yeah. Um, hey, you won this one. Okay. Well, let's get these bad boys in, I suppose. I'd say moving that on. Yeah, I'm moving Jerome on. I don't have any special guys, right? They're all just regular veteran yep. French infantry. Mm -hmm. Okay. They're all special. Yeah. Ask, <laughs> their, ask their moms. Come on now. That's right. <laughs> You you don't have any uh, orphaned. Well, don't climb up too Stop. much over here because I got cal I got cavalry coming on right here. Stop. Oh, I thought they were coming on the other side. Sorry. Um, you, you you don't have any orphaned rabble. You need to stop <laughs> with that. Picking on picking on your Viet Viennese. I was about to say Vietnamese. Picking on your well, we don't really know since they're orphans. They could be Vietnamese. Picking. We we don't know. Those guys won, for the record. <laughs> <clears throat> do they have to be touching the um, this, uh, side, or do I just like move them on as if they're in this formation? Um, I mean, the idea is you've got... To, because you're in March, you've got six. You've got a full six you could go, as far as I'm concerned. Okay, and that. So, I don't want to be in shooting range. So I get to go to about the. Air. Just bring him, Yeah, I would say just bring him to the edge of the tree line. All right, because uh, so we don't have to spend the um, the complication. Got it. Well, in that case, there's no point in them being in March, is there? How far to the left am I allowed to deploy? It just if you got as long as you're making a decent effort to keep the space. I'm not that troubled by it. You know, are you, you know, you've got the spacing you've got. That's a certain <clears throat> line. <clears throat> you've got a lot of dudes. Yeah. Didn't realize I had this many dudes. No sense playing if you're not playing with a lot of dudes. Gigantic 54 millimeter dudes. Love it. Love it. <clears throat> now, if I remember correctly, in LaSalle, you get to do everything once, right? Yep. That is correct. Okay. Well, per per brigade per, or battalion. Well, no, per, no, each unit. Each yeah, unit yeah. can yeah. do everything one time. But, they can, I'm, you know. I'm sorry, what I was meaning, though, is you could move and then... One one unit, right? And then later mm -hmm. on, you can move a different unit. Right. When just make right, sense. right, yeah. But let's say hypothetically, for example, I I changed formations with Von Merlin coming over too far, yeah. But he hasn't cool. moved yet, so he could he still is capable of moving. Yep. Yeah, there <laughs> is. If you got the mo. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just trying to remember. <laughs> Whether <laughs> trying to get out of Shaco mind and into LaSalle mind You've got from notebook. last night to today. Yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> get your notebook out. It's Velker. Yeah, it's right here. Look out, it's Velker. Hi, Velker. Hello. The stranger. You're the stranger now. How you doing? You get shoes? I'm all right. I got some shoes. I got a lock. Got some new toothpaste. Okay. Ooh, yeah. Like Ooh, I said, gotta yeah, remember, I got cavalry coming on right here. Oh, right. Um, 
you get a phone. Do you are you planning on just going through here, or are you planning on doing something else with it? Good luck, As of right now, thank you. you. As of right now, Velker is rooting for down. Right the three. record will reflect. Oh, I knew I loved that kid. <laughs> in that case, uh, and I can't deploy anywhere on your right side. Is that nope. correct? Nope. Nope. You got from here to here. Well. Gonna be a jumble of French. Perfect jam. Well, if I play this right, it's just gonna be continuous lines hitting you. <laughs> <laughs> That's the goal, anyway. Uh, so there's my gigantic mess. For a whole point, that was a point. Yeah, I. And at no point did it get within uh, proximity nope. of the enemy. So, Dalinar, you're still at it. So we've got one. Moving. Oh, right, and then so we'll have one left after this, right? Correct. Okay. If you stick them in March, don't they move something ridiculous? Horse. Yes, but uh, yeah, but there's so much in front of me. Why you didn't put them in March? <laughs> I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, in March they would go twelve. <laughs> So instead, they're going like eight or something. So you could just, yeah, you can shove them right up behind my guys. Yell at them to move over. Or Get over! Meet me. Out of the way. <laughs> what cracks me up is that the distance from the road. Just over to here is five feet. Holy crap. I don't think you could physically uh, play this in real life. Hey, Jerome. Yes. You've got your can. Uh, right. I did. I did forget my but can. No, oh. But, no, you don't get Kellerman. Put him back. You? We don't. Right. Oh, that's Kellerman. Sorry. Yep, I realize that. Um, where do I want this cannon? But you get Pierre. You can have those. There you go. Um, you got this one there. You get the fifth Lancers. Yeah, from the left edge of the table to Perponcher is one Velker. <laughs> it's one Velker. <laughs> Actually, I don't know how far that is. Well, it's uh, a lot of that would be six, Was it six feet? Yeah, yeah that was six, six feet. feet. Yeah, mm -hmm. to to uh, to Struck's point, uh, I I I don't know the le the left to right isn't the problem. It's gonna be the what is that eight two. It's trying to figure out how you're gonna reach to the middle of a twelve foot table. Very carefully. We've often said that uh, Tom Cruise Mission Impossible rig. It is. <laughs> It's interesting for this to, to maybe this strategy is a bit interesting, um, but if I just stick them all here, hey, they aren't going to go anywhere anyway. <laughs> mm. That's enough to not to crack, even with the table being the right size. Well, you'll notice they're about to shoot at each other, so we must be doing okay. Yep. It's not like some games that can march <laughs> around for three hours and don't meet yeah. meet each other, right? Yeah, no, I, I, All think, right. I, I think we're good. So you did that. <laughs> did at any point you get to within the uh, range of the enemy? No. No. You going to spend your last one? Do you want to save it, just in case? Yeah, we'll save it for now. We'll pass. Pass. Uh, the, uh, the, 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 what, the coalition. Coalition? Coalition... Okay. Um, do anything have? you need to do right away here, Mike? No, not right away. Okay. Uh, I am going to move Von Merlin here. Mm -hmm. Bearing in mind, you just moved four feet. <laughs> <laughs> What is that, like two-thirds of a Velker? 
Let's do That's what I'm going to do all, all my measurements now. Let's just do measurements in Velkers. <laughs> yes. If this was a real life table, you'd almost you need like the hole in the middle so people can like go in oh, and, there you go. and move yeah, units that around. Yeah, that you could pop up through the center of, sure. No, no, yeah. no, no, no. You, you do the Mission Impossible thing with the overhead yeah. uh, well, that's, that's how, system. That's how we rig up Velker. Yeah. <laughs> or the okay, big Mike. sticks that they use in like the, the movies when they're dealing with planes. Oh, yeah, the croupier thing. All right, so that's one of those points. I see that's been paid. Well done. Anything else from the Allies? Yeah, I'm going to move some troops. All right, go ahead. Over here, uh, Duke of Brunswick. Mm -hmm. This will be two points because it's a complication. Yep. I can move up the rest of his guys too, right? Uh, Duke of Brun, as long as it's Duke of Brunswick. Uh oh, my game just crashed. I'll be back in a second. We'll be here for okay. you. Just type you a message. <laughs> what was it? Well, see, you could, <laughs> well, you he, could, put, it, he, you could he, say, he put it in the public chat so you, you can say. see. <laughs> Did you want to move these guys? Would you? No, I'm going to hold them back, I think, for right now. So. All right, that's it for the Duke of Brunswick. That's two points. Anything else for the allies? Or was that within, was that within four of the enemy? I don't think it could be. Yeah. No. Uh, no. No. The, nope. the cavalry is the, yeah, the cavalry they, up there is so they, they didn't come past it or up to point, it. So good point. All right. So you still have it, allies? It's still you. Three points to go. Um, uh, all right. Anything else you want to do over here? I'm going to take a pass. Okay. Um. Let's see. Uh, change team. Yeah, I don't have anything over here I need to do at this point. I did not get your message if you sent it. No, I didn't send it. Okay, we'll pass. Back over to the French. Well, um, if we pass, that ends the turn. Right. And they lose and they lose out on three MO. I think that's a good idea. No, well, I was thinking about so not have to worry about winning an issue, doing the formation change now. Uh, I can't. I'm in water. I'd have to spend two. Oh, damn it. That's why I asked earlier. Well, we still use what's-his-name for it, but we could at least get these guys into form out, if you want. Um, that's, so how, he's got a four, a range of four or six to do his... Uh, because I'm just wondering... So if you, if you plant him somewhere, we might be able to actually do it where he's... Um, getting everything and then we don't have to worry about it at all. I think all. it's six inch or so it's no. it's three is it four uh four base widths that he has a range right, of so he, he we can't get your your cannon but this would theoretically hit everything here. So if you want to spend the one to to do something on your end, go ahead. I'm just doing a formation change, so if you if you want to, you may. Oh, then yeah, sure. What the hell? Why not? That's uh, uh, you. And you. <clears throat> All right, so French, is that it for your formation changes? I believe so, yes. I believe so. All right, so that takes you out. Um, none of that was in the face of the enemy, but it doesn't matter, so we go over to the Allies. Anything? Well, no. technically it was in the face of the enemy, but that doesn't, doesn't matter. Right. Oh, it was? Okay. Oh, well, it was. Yeah. That, yeah. yeah. But, a hey, uh, Gillies, what I was thinking is, mm -hmm. um, we got three points, right? Yep. Um, maybe adjusting 
moving Papancher just a little bit and then doing a volley fire. I think we have enough points to do. Y both you things. would need to be within one inch of me to do that, so I don't think he would be able to get that far. The one you mean woods. one base width? One, one base sorry, width. one base width. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to get far enough in the woods to shoot any of my guys. Oh, I was thinking it was four base width. Nope. Now, the charge is... Yeah, if you wanted to charge him, you could not, do it. Not, not volley fire. Okay. That's what that's what I got wrong. That's all right. Let him come to you. Yeah, <laughs> I'm good with that. Time is on our side. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's, it's not like he's not coming. <laughs> yeah. You know. I'm pretty sure I've made my intentions very clear. <laughs> <laughs> well, in that case, Achilles, I'm good then. Okay. Um, let's see. The only thing you may want to look at is like if you needed to some of you guys here. I don't know. Yeah. If you, I don't know if they would if you could get them in the line if you needed to if they'd be too close to each other. Well, that's exactly what I was looking at at this point. Okay. I can, in fact, move Picton because he hasn't moved. Yep. <clears throat> and then I can do a formation change. We have we have more than enough for that. So, okay. So I'm going to uh, move Picton's brigade. They go destruct. More a question, eh? Um, kinda. It's just ending up that way. Yeah. It's not a bad thing, though. Okay. <clears throat> I think I should have more than enough room. Okay. <clears throat> and uh, let's see. So that was one. And then we're going to do a formation change. All right. Look, Jim, I even have the flags in the right oh, place. I'm wa believe me, you, I'm watching. You know that. <laughs> Fun fact, if you, whichever base you pick up, like, so um, if you highlight them all and then pick up a base and you press one of the numbers to change the formation, whichever one you're holding is going to be the regulating base for that formation. I didn't understand a word he just said, but I'm done. <laughs> <clears throat> he said something technical about pushing buttons and something, but it's a uh, it's, it's something lost. that I'm now going to test because I think he's, that's how I was just doing. He's he I, he is uh, he is once again teaching me things that are valuable. This is like has mojo, but just from destruct. What he is saying to you, now I'm copying this. I'll move him over here, Achilles. If you take these four guys and highlight them like okay. that. Whichever okay. one you grab, let's uh -huh. say I grab the guy with the flag, and I yeah. hit one, he does that, two, three. It works from behind him. Yeah. So, so it's a nice, easy way to form a column. Sharp. I like it. How many different ways can I screw that up? Many. <laughs> At least four, <laughs> as demonstrated. Um, okay, cool. Well, that's the whole turn most groovy <clears throat> that takes us to turn two but i must needs adjust because jerome arrived <clears throat> wow and jerome brought with him one two three four five six seven eight nine battalions increasing the french skirmish by 27 which means they now go to 90 i'm sorry i'm sorry professor i'm really sorry okay but four of my units are in march columns they at least don't count 
Okay, so you got four, so that takes it down to 12, which means it takes it to 78. Anything else I should know about to modify? Oh my gosh, it's now 78 to 78. Uh-oh. That's, that's <laughs> this, awesome. is, this is why I wanted that formation change. Just to get those die rolls. Oh, that's why you wanted to... Uh... Well, that's what we're going to use. What's his name? Yeah, Nay is going Nay. to quickly form the Leger into something that will repel these horses. Yeah, well, that's uh, only slightly ahead of where we are. Um, we have now, I believe the French now have five brigades, correct? Eight. Four. 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 Just four? Fury. Yeah. And, yeah, just four. All right. And, uh, and Coalition, how many do you have? Uh, four. <laughs> yeah, same Which number. Is how so many? Four. You have four as well, so it's four to four. Plus baggage for another two. Exactly, so now it's six to six. Now, I gather that the French are not using the general for his uh, ability to influence the Mo, correct? Correct. Correct. All right, allies, roll for your Mo if that's what you're doing. One oh, that didn't bonus help point. Much. <laughs> Very good. Now we do the skirmish phase. 78 to 78. Oh man, I'm surprised this isn't crash computers. <laughs> <laughs> this is what all that processing power was for. Right. Gigantic dice fountains. <laughs> Thousands of years of technological innovation to get to this. And that's an amazingly <laughs> small number of six French. That really is. One, two, three. Yep. Eleven. Eleven. Eleven to how many? We, we won by five. By five. So, Oof. You get two. No, we do skirmies. We do yep. skirmies. Oh, you do. Ah. I like that. We haven't tried that yet. How does it? How do you guys find it? Uh, we well, let's put it this way: we've never gone back. Okay, that's a that's a ringing endorsement. Yeah, it's it. Uh, well, I'll let the group speak. Um, I think Ron and OJ, you would be the two that know it both ways. What do you think? Uh, I don't I like even to, remember what. I don't I like the skirmish way. way I, I I like skirmies. I don't even remember what the other way was. It gave you more mo. It oh, gave that's you, right. It gave you half. It gave you half the amount in extra mo. <clears throat> right. That's right. I do like okay. the scare music that makes it a little bit more interesting, and it helps. It actually helps out a lot more. It can. All right. However, okay. we now have now. So the way this works, you've got to be across from a unit that is in the the unit that throws out the skirmisher has to be in line, and um, it has to not be within a base with the line that is drawn has to be not within a base width of cavalry. So I ask the allies, where do you want to give some skirmies out? There's some opportunities for sure. Uh, it looks like... Okay. What's the distance they can go out? Eight. Eight? Base width. So, um, for example, I can put one on this one. Yes, but the emergency formation change won't be affected by that. Correct. Just so you're Correct. aware. Correct. Okay, I can still put one on this one, right? <laughs> yes, I, yeah. I just if that was your intention to stop it changing formation, it won't work. Is what I was trying to. And it doesn't stop. I, yeah, it doesn't stop it anyway. But yeah. Well, considering I would have never even thought about that part. <laughs> that is true. He is a lieutenant. Oh uh, wow! That explains a lot, Captain oh, Sir. Yeah. Uh, cat demoted captain. me. <laughs> I know I did. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He is a captain, and I'm not a sir, sir. I work. For you are a now. You're a civilian. He works for a living. <laughs> a retired civilian. Um. All right. So that's okay. two. You got. Uh, three, you got three more, right? Well, wait a minute. Who? No, no. no I, we didn't put one here. No. Is, is it for one no, for no, every one you're out, above? But I don't know the, yes. It's, I don't know it's, the, one, okay. it's one for every one you win by. Okay. Okay. So it's I not like the, the, the every two. Advantage of got it. Putting one on here, We're, if it doesn't impact the emergency. 
formation change. Yeah, it's not. Well, he can shoot, and that would affect his shooting, but that's it. Uh, or if I decide to, like, I, if I'm crazy enough to moves. decide to move. <laughs> yeah. Put one here on oh, the that's second a... battalion, 93rd line. Second battalion, okay. Yep, go ahead. There, got it. Three. Or, uh, sorry, that's two. Three more. And we can't put them in the woods, is that mm -hmm. right? Sure you can. Oh, we... Okay. That's a great place to put skirmishers, to be honest. Yeah. Honestly, <laughs> yeah, great. so if like I can have one more. Or... Yep, if we can put one yeah. here. How many will that give us? That's three. We're down to two left. Okay, so go ahead and put one more. All right, might as well put it on the second battalion, ninety second line then. Mm -hmm. Well, Delinor, you're free to do whatever and... you want. <laughs> I know, right? You want to put one over there on the? Yeah, I'm going to put line? one. Use That's... this well. I'm going to put one over here. <clears throat> Are you guys that afraid of me? Jeez. No, we just gotta no, find some place to put these guys. <laughs> they're just lacking with these guys here. They're afraid of these it's guys very falling. Eager skirmishers. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. So that is six over here total for the French. Total of what? Seven. Seven over here for the Allies, and the Allies won. But before we do anything, we get the intervention phase. Bump. All right, I'll just bum, bum, slap bum. Nate down. He's with it's within four. Yeah. So it's you could put him in a lot of different places. To be honest, they're they're gonna square up. <laughs> See how come Destruct knows how to do it? Been playing this for a long time. I'm just saying, the others have to. Hey, I like my octagon formation. You've been watching too much. <laughs> oh. You've been watching too much of Waterloo. We were um we were doing like drill practice one time and reenacting, and we decided to form double rotating orb. So, <laughs> um, we had we had half the men form like an outer orb, and the and an inner orb, and they rotated, and each person like uh, reloaded and fired as the two rotated in different directions and moved forward. It was great. Stuff I don't know how you'd recreate that. I, I have a fancy hunch you're blocking that gun, but I figured you knew. Uh, hmm. I guess I could have formed them to this side of uh -huh. the yeah, guy. Okay. Can... You're almost certainly gonna. Well, no, you'll get. Yeah, you can get to shoot that guy. There you go. That's a better choice, I think. Yeah. Yes, gentlemen, form rhombus directly in front of our own artillery. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you know that's how, how it is in the manual? Monsieur, yes. I was just about to say, I'm looking through the manual and I'm finding that <laughs> nowhere. Hey, Ron, just looking through the rules. Just so you, in case you forgot, cavalry cannot charge a town. <laughs> Just, just putting that out there. Sorry, <laughs> right. we have Opalchenia in reserve. I was waiting for the Opalchenia <laughs> one. Uh, I was surprised you put the Skirmies as Opalchenia. I think that's the best that's going to get with that bridge. I'm okay um, with that. And... That's perfectly fine. And they're not going to okay. stay in town. They're going to go in front of the town and just challenge your cavalry. <laughs> just give you a look. Mm. Give you a bad look. Let it, go ahead, charge us. Go ahead. We dare you. Give you a bad look. We I'll have pointed him, sticks. While guzzling their vodka <laughs> out of their bear, bear skin. That's you, you make it sound like that's in any way a bad thing. I don't understand. I know, right? It, it is if you're the French. I suppose. Now, I have an important question for you there, Mike. Yes. We have a We have kind of a choice here that we need to make. Uh-huh. Think of England. <laughs> when it comes to the uh, when it comes to the artillery, I'm just moving way, it temporarily. Yes. Yeah, right. Which way do we want to use it? Because um, if we if we volley fire, we can do that right off the bat, and that's great because it might hurt them early. I'm sorry, not volley fire. I mean uh, bombard. Well, but this if, one... if we do that. Well, this one's within four inches, so I think he has to... No, that's Shackle. He doesn't have to do anything. Okay. 
Now that if if what you're saying is he can't bombard, he has to use canister. That's correct. Yeah. Right. Sorry. Not the volley. The square. Oh yeah. wait. Yeah. Now that I think about it, if we if we bombard, you can hold back a gun. You don't have to use it, right? Yeah. You and, can you yeah. can use whatever so units you, can, you want. So you can wait on them to to use it for volley. Right. You could do a okay. volley now with just the one gun too. You don't have to shoot the other gun. It's it's about how much ammo do you want to waste doing exactly. parcel out orders? Right, right. That's that's the trade off. That yeah. that's always well, been. The nice thing about being on defense is that you don't need as much Love of the ammo. So yeah. at least not. At the <clears throat> right. Yep. All right. So is that the uh, big formation change from Nay? It is. All right, sure. allies, you're up. Okay, so yes, I guess we will go with Bombard. All right, I'm going to swing over to your side. Where do you want to start? Uh, start on your side, Mike. Just right. I figured I was spitting skirmishers. With whoever you would intend to use. Yeah, that's fair enough. Actually, I think I got that shot right there. Okay. Do you want to hold those guns for the for when he moves up on you, though? I was thinking about it, but man, that's a tempting target. Ah, uh, yes, this fire. is the this is the dilemma. I love it. <laughs> you know, you get about five hits right there, potential. Mm -hmm. sure. I don't disagree with you. Yeah, but... no, no, it's your choice. Uh, I'm just pointing out the options mm -hmm, here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, I I know. Fight your well, brigades. I suppose sir. the thing, though, Let's... is, right, like, we can't charge you now, and if you win initiative next turn, it, you get to volley anyway. Right. Well, let's just go ahead and take the bombard up this way. All right, straight up the pipe. Three for four. Nay's baggage. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Might hit his spare hat. Three. Oh! Oof. Wow! He sticks that. That's nasty. Three for six in the back. Done. Three for six. One. Same thing. Mm -hmm. Done. And that's it. That's it. Oh, right. The yeah, gun. he's got the gun. He's got the gun. So that's three for that's three for six as well. Just barely rolled over. Actually, that one's a hit. It's three for five. Nope, oh, no, because nope, nope, it's, nope. it's not it's valid. That's modified. right. I forgot about that. Forgot. Next oh, look. See, I try to get my own gun to hit. Look at that. <laughs> Next bombardment. It's over to uh, well, we only have one other gun, so it's going to be mine. Um, this one here? Yeah, it's such a pretty gun. You got Perponcher's gun here. No, he's uh, that would be a volley. Oh, that's volley. Well, range. you don't have... Yeah, because uh, yeah, he would have... Yeah, inside you have to. Yep. You must load and why would I want to do a bombard if no, I can yeah, volley out? Of course. I can't Straight down anyways. the pipe. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about that. Either that or I can go for this gun here. Mm -hmm. Although I, I hate wasting fire on counter battery, but well, you you could but you could hit the counter but you could hit the artillery and bounce it through to the two both infantry on the backside. You Very can't. true. You can get yeah. all of them. You can shoot all of these guys if you wanted to. However, he is now uh, unlimbered, so it's going to be a harder shot. That's going to be, what, a six? I'm going to need a six to hit. No, no. It's a three for four. Oh, it is? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a three well, for yeah, four at it's, the front. It's... Everybody else is a three for six. Okay. I'll take it. Then. It's just harder for it to stick. To, to stick the hit, yeah. Because counter battery. So three for three for four at the front. Okay. Yeah, only one. Three for six. Three for six. And nothing again. Oh, one in the back. Right. That was the only other gun, right? All right, we'll, yeah. resolve, we'll resolve that one right away, then, Achilles. We'll go one for six on the okay. gun. Ouch. Oh! Wow! That, that's a hurdy bit. 
And that's not rallyable either. Correct. No. Correct. That's a that that makes that choice a little better. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it's a pretty. Remember, uh... I drove off one of your guns last time. I remember. Yeah. And, and, and had the other, and I, and that was pretty early too. And then the other one, I damaged there toward the end. One for four mm -hmm. in the back. One person that I play with, he created a grand battery and just picked off all my artillery. It was pretty rough. I stuck that one too. Well, it's a, it's a, you're at that point you're playing the numbers game, and if you win, you win. Right? All right, we come over here to OJ's, which I think was three at the front, so that's three for four. One. Nice. I think he hit anybody else, right? Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. these cabs. No, there was one in there. That's, that's one for five. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nope. Nope. All right. Take your point for that bombardment, please. And now uh, call something else out. Oh, I think I already did. We started at seven, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to move Merlin. All right. Go, Merlin. It's your birthday. Yeah, LBW is not, uh, LBW, Michael is not on tonight. He was on last night hanging out. Oh, and nice. the horses explode. <laughs> what did you do, Ray? Oh, that was me, and I guess I must not have let go of the... That's a fair bet. The button. Okay, how do I make them go back to where they were? You don't. You, once you let go of them, you can't reset the way it has it shown us how to do. Ah, uh, nuts. So I, I think Ron's giving you a fair target as to where he would have been. Yeah, I think it was. Seems Seems pretty rational. Except you want them facing the right way. Oh. Which way are they facing? I thought that was the front of the horse. Oh. <laughs> this is why you're not in the cavalry. <laughs> These are critical pieces of information to have. He was in the, he was in the armor, but not the cavalry. Right. Uh, I actually was in the cavalry. I know you were. I've seen it. That's, oh. that's, the, that's my point. I've seen your unit insignia. The only time we saw horses were parades. Yeah, but you wore the hats. That's true. And the spurs. True. And the at and the attitude. <laughs> yeah, definitely the attitude. The attitude the was more the more than anything. Okay. The swagger. That's that, that that's the word I was looking for. All right, Merlin is done. And the saber. Yeah, true. Yeah. You, I got you, all I, of that. I think I heard you paying that point for Merlin. Yes. All right. So you said obviously was nowhere near the enemy. So you're up. Has Alton come on this turn for us? Is that right? Turn two. I think that's right. But let me confirm. We just may want to hold something back to move him up some, if if that is indeed the case. Alton, where are you? Uh, turn, there you are. you are. You are correct, sir. It is turn two. Right. Okay. Uh, do you have anything you need to do over here, Mike? Mm, no, not at the moment. All right. Might as well bring him on. Where does uh, Alton come on in? On the road. Flanking. On the road, flanking the road. This one right there. Oh, that road. Okay. Now, question. Where to bring him in? Looks sorry, like. Which, which road? One with this baggage. one. This one. Okay. This one. Yeah. Um, why don't you take him and bring him in on your side over there? Okay. I will say, LBW, if you didn't catch it earlier, this is actually Michael's Katra scenario for Shaco 2. We've just adapted it for LaSalle 2. 
I know they're backwards. I'll get them flipped around here. On the edge of the table, right? Is where we measure them? Yeah. About here. I'm just going to do this first. I'm going to get the lead units lined up here. Let me see. Within how, what's the width that they can come on from the road? I mean, don't make it too much. Like a couple base width. Uh, yeah. Base width. yeah. I mean, if if it's a unit here, a unit here, and a unit here, I got no problems. Okay, and that's what I was thinking. It's something like this. Yep, that works. Okay. And I apologize. Is it four inches? No, six. Four, six base six. width. Well, they're. In, had to move you've got them in line, right? Oh, they're in line. No, or they're going to be. No, they're oh, gonna be no, column. I see. Those are the heads of each column. I, I yeah, need, yeah. I do need to. I need to look at the table closer to the table. I keep looking from way that's, up high. That's, that's why the I can't see. You're, you're either having to zoom out, trying to see what, everything that's going on, or you're zoomed in. Yeah. To get enough detail as to what's going. Yeah. On. If you if you bring them in in March column, Mike, it's ten. Which is why I can't tell, you know, which the front of the horse, because <laughs> I'm looking from like 20 miles up I'm sure in a that, satellite view. I'm sure that's what you <laughs> told the recruiter. I just told the recruiter, sure, that sounds great. An apartment in Hawaii? That sounds awesome. <laughs> My dad, when he went to boot camp for the Air Force, somebody showed up with golf clubs. <laughs> nice. That's bold. You said 10, Jim? 10, if you're in March, yep. Yeah. My one head lead unit keeps getting off center of everybody else when I do that. It's interesting. Collision stuff. How far does the how far does the uh, artillery move? Limber. Uh, yes. Should be, should be. That's like a lot. Twelve limbered guns are yeah. Uh, ten, ten. I'm sorry. Ten. 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 Oh, they're the same distance. Okay. Yeah, I was think I was looking at horse guns. <clears throat> Some, there's a lot. It's interesting. It's only this is one of those cases where it's only one mo point, but these brigades are huge. Yep. Yeah, the only thing that recruiter did not lie to me about was there was a lot of sand. Mm -hmm. It just wasn't a beach. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> they left out the water. Well, I'm going to say accurate. <laughs> if you want beach? Join the Marines. <laughs> uh. Hey, Achilles, do me a favor. Swap <laughs> these two you guys around for me while I bring some of the others on. Get the flag up in the front there for me, please, and thank you. Alright. Sorry, just starting to speed it up just a little bit. Without Jim Krausen at me too, too much. See, now this is what the, here, watch this, Achilles. Check this out. How upset he gets. Check this out. <laughs> oh, why, you gotta why you gotta throw stuff? I think I might be lagging a little. Okay. Ah. That was pretty. Pretty neat. <laughs> real real parade ground stuff. I could hear John Philip Sousa in the background. I'm telling you. <laughs> no idea how I brought these guys all up. Once again I ask, what did you do, Ray? <laughs> I followed your instructions. Uh-huh. I did what IT support told me to do. <laughs> 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 
famous last words that. Where do you See want that they, they, right here, just back here in line. You mean in column? Column, yes, that too. Yeah, yeah that's the, uh, that, that collision thing is, uh, that's Giorgio's Lanvare. They're just, they got a little bit extra. Something must be hanging off. I don't think so. I think he just didn't work the collider box just so. Yeah, mm. I, I was. And it's weird. I was it's, looking. It's for, some was, of them. Hmm? Yeah. Oh, I'm just saying. It's some and not others. It's. Mm -hmm. It's like I say. It's his landfair mostly. <clears throat> but that, however, is a profound third world problem, and given the context, is incredibly ungrateful because I love his fix. <laughs> and you still bought him a beer. I did. Bought him a Even with this. Minor problem. <laughs> well, it wasn't a good beer. <laughs> <laughs> it was though. He was easy. He was better at ordering than I ever was. Okay, <laughs> that's everybody that for Alton. That that's was all. a whole point, and it was not in the face of the enemy. So, allies, <clears throat> continue. All right. Uh, let's see. That should put us down to four, right? Yeah. You should charge my squares. That sounds like a wonderful the, idea. Is that the plan? Is that the A plan? <laughs> All right, Mike, do you got anything else you need to do over there? No, not at the moment. I don't either at the moment, so let's pass. Uh, you should go, LBW, over to armchairdragoons.com. Sign up there in the in the forums and introduce yourself. And I'll get you onto the Discord server. And just like tonight, I come in and I'm sitting there playing with my own bloody self. And the next thing I, I didn't know, sound I right. I got four. Yeah, it really didn't. And the next thing you know, we got four players. We are definitely not full up. It varies evening to evening and game to game. So uh, come on over. ArmchairDragoons.com over in the forums. Don't cost nothing. Except maybe your reputation. And dignity. Yeah. <laughs> Which we will yeah. ruin when you get here. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> That's for look, sure. I mean, look at Ron. He used to be a respected man. He was <laughs> veteran, man of the trades, yeah. man of the people. Yeah. Now and look at him now. Velvet line now, sack. Yeah, yeah, and, and, and he wouldn't have any other way. PST, That's right. PST. PTSD for Milpilchania. Every time he cringes into a, goes into a small ball every time he sees a velvet line or a burlap sack, and he wouldn't <laughs> change a moment of it. Mm -hmm. Nope. The, um, our All spouses, right. on the other hand, <laughs> are you are you LBW over there? LBW. Uh, so are, we're waiting for the allies to do a thing. Whatever. I think they is. said they passed. We passed. Oh, sorry. Okay. No, we're waiting on those guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. I did, wasn't sure if that was. Yeah, I missed that. Um, so I missed that too. Del, right. uh, what are you? What are you planning on doing? We're bombarding. Okay, I only have one. I only have the one gun to bombard with. I know. Okay. It's not interrupting anything. I mean, it's like it can't interrupt yeah, it. So, all right. All right. Well, you want to shoot yours first? This way. That's gonna be a lot. Yeah. But it's at that plus. It's at that naughty plus one. Yeah, it's that plus Four one. For, so, which way? Well, remember, it's an alley. So, who's it gonna hit first? It's gonna hit. Man, that's close. Uh -huh. I'm going to call it even. Who do you want to hit first, Ron? Oh, no, it isn't. 95th Rifles get hit first. They are a little bit further forward. A little bit. So four for five. Four for five on the 95th. Ah! Four for six. Four for six. Four. For, oh, there's one. There's just I staggered him. That's not what I intended. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you, citizen. Four for six. Four for six. And four for six. Okay. Next gun. 
Uh, we've got this one that's gonna shoot like that. You know he shot one one too many times. Why? Why? He fired six times, but wasn't there one, only five? Two, three, four, five, six. Wait, which ones? He's oh, he one, hits both two, of these three, in the front. Four, five, okay. six. Ah, it's, that's it's what a, I did. It's, it's a lane. It's a lane. Okay, my fault. No worries. So th oh, this lane is gonna. It's gonna hit. It's gonna hit this horse first. Okay, so that horse first. Four for uh, four for four. Let me just grab my. Yep. Four for four. Uh, three. Oof. Four for six. Nope. Four for six. Nope. Four. Wow. Oh. Four. For... Oh. Wow. <laughs> Nope. We're due. Oh, look, it's straight. Where else does that go? Yeah. Second Two, hole. three, four, yeah, five. Yeah, no, without hitting his own unit. Yeah, I can't hit his own unit. Yeah. So it's there. It would hit. Yeah. I, it's, yeah. It's those guys. Yeah. Okay, so. One. Not three. Other guns? I think that's it. Oh, that one. That one is not. Uh, that's Navali, yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, so we got to make them stick. We'll start back with you, Destruct. Uh, three for five on okay. SSRs. One. One. They certainly didn't like it. All right. We crawl all the way back here and say one for four. Nope. Ron, this is the uh, Lunenburg Landwehr, one for four. Got him. They got decent resolve. Surprised. Yeah, I'm surprised. But they've got very low strength, and they uh, they fray easily. That's the thing. They've got a they fray. That's easily. true. Uh, one, I guess being shaken is. Yeah, one for four. Being shaken's nasty for them. Because you're not getting out of it. No. Is that it? That's everybody. Yep. Pay yep. for your bombard, please, if you haven't, and uh, do your next thing. Um, mm. Would these skirmishers do what to me in terms of moving? When you move, they will get to take one shot at you to try to stick it as to your resolve. So they'll get one shot for four to try to hit you. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm going to need two pips to move and if that's okay Delamar. are you gonna move to in, uh, within where they can interrupt well i yes i'm gonna have to if i do anything well if we're gonna do an interrupt deal i sure you we don't want to do more damage first well it was kind of getting things into position in order to do more damage before they do damage to you so they've their artillery this artillery can't volley me now, and none of this art infantry can do anything to me. So it's sort of All if right, I move up, can I it. can shoot. Okay. But if I don't move up, I'm not being useful. All right, go ahead, move two. Okay. So, oh, um, can someone? I can move up for two within three of these guys somewhere. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, that's right. Here they come. Uh, someone needs to measure through from there as well. I'm at 2.9. My measuring skills are almost good enough. Go. Um, move these guys out of the way first. Um, do you want to take your pot shot at me before I move this guy? Yep. OJ, that's a shot for you. Yep. One die, four bear. Yep. Sorry. Long ping. Long ping only, please. Mm -hmm. Five. Got him. 
Okay. Now, is that just an automatic thing then? Yep. Um, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, you might as well you might as well just do the other shots as well because they'll be moving also. Are you going to move them? Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. this guy here. Six. Okay, got him. And this guy over here. Five. Wow. Skirmishers hey. reckon it. Skirmishers are reckon it today. All right. All right, thank you. And I'll continue on doing what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. This man is charging. Oh, there it is. Uh, this man cannot charge, so but he won't. Uh, he can only move one so that or within three of that. Can someone measure within three of that enemy unit? Perfect. Wow, that was... Look at you. Fancy. I know. Fancy. Uh, I don't know if that's within three or not. Probably a little too close. Eh, well, I gotta get it from this edge, though. Yeah. A little bit back. Tiny bit, tiny bit. There you go. There you go. And I guess this guy will just... Mm -hmm. Sally forth, as it were. Yes. That's Jerome, I can't move him. That's Jerome, I can't move him. These guns are just going to go a little bit, and these ones are going to move over just a tad. To make room for this one later. Um, I think that's the entirety of Foy that can move or is willing to move. Oh, wait, I guess I can move this line up. Are they in range? The river. Uh, they would have been going through these through cannons. The guns, through the guns. Very good. Yes, yes, yes. Elect so, through the power okay. of electricity. Yeah, right, that, I am a that, certain. That means uh, we got us a melee, kids and campers. Those are always fun, aren't they? <laughs> it's what we live for, uh, man. All it's going to be is a negative. Both in, You're both in Yeah, because we're both in you're okay. Both, that, no, well, let's see what happens. So you're uh, what are you? What are you? What are you? You're five a four. To six. You're a four, and he's a five. Four to five. Nope. Ooh. Ooh. Six. Never rolled over for me. Just spun on its axis. Oh, oh, I like that. Yes. Insta kill. Epic death. Insta kill. Which entitles you. Now you have a choice. Would Huzzah! You you get a. You oh, get... I'm, I'm taking. Go ahead. I'm taking the huzzah, like the, the I'm taking the movement, extra movement if I need it. All right, let me slap a hood. You you do know what we use for huzzah markers, right? Yeah, this is. Really <laughs> uh, this is... <laughs> yeah. Because... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ron. Tell uh -huh. us how you feel. Tell us how you feel, Ron. How does this make you feel? <laughs> Share. <laughs> no! Wait a second. <laughs> you recognize it? Do you destruct? Yeah. Just. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, it's uh, not a <laughs> I don't. And did you, uh, what did you roll? You rolled a six, so you don't even have to take that disruption. Oh. So you, sir, get a huzzah. Huzzah. For doing Curl to the corner, thumb and melt. <laughs> Still a good win. Um, who did you, yeah, who did you punch out? I have to record them for posterity. 3rd Battalion, 2nd Nassau Line. That's one of the units that did really, really well at Waterloo in our big uh, La High Sant game. So they, they won't Not be around. Today. <laughs> well, they, they they ran away in order to survive to fight that one, right? Oh, so. that could be it. That could that could easily be it. Uh, that, however, is an interruptible offense. Allies. <clears throat> All right, Mike. Yes, sir. What would you like to do, sir? Are they within volley range then? Who's that? Remember, uh, volley range in the trees is one base. One base, so right? this yes, this uh, yes, you would be, but yeah, you'd you, get the these, one these dice. These two guys could each shoot one die over here. 
look at each. Okay. But these yeah. guys over here. Wouldn't, wouldn't this guy have to shoot? Feet. He would, but he's out this. of range. You can't see him. He can. Oh, that's not trees. That's not trees. Yeah, this guy, as is being said, would have to choose probably because it's that's pretty equidistant. Would have to choose between either the second, the second battalion ninety third, or the second battalion of the hundred. Right. Okay. So at I, least the cannon bombarded, so I don't have to worry about that. Yeah. Here's a here's a question for you though, Mike. Uh huh. He just uh, moved. All all, he just moved all those guys in front of you, right? Uh huh. So. Do you, would you rather do a formation change and put these guys into line first and then volley later? That I think you have just enough room to... Oh, I don't know. We might want to have a call if well, you were going to put him into line rather you he, touch he, me. He could do it he, off he, the back. Yeah, he could do it off the back. Oh, yeah, he could. Yeah. Okay, that, yeah, that's that's fair. That's fair. Yeah. But that would take out of range of these guys, right? Yep. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Yep. Well, the other thing actually, I was thinking... Is I could move. No, it wouldn't. You'd still be in range. Would he? Is it four? Yeah. Yeah, it's four. Uh, but are but are you in the woods? Is the question. Yeah, but guy. these. Yeah, but when you form up, yeah, these guys could be in the woods, so you might not be able to hit them. Right. That's okay. Because the other thing I was thinking is I could move a paunch or some, and these guys up in the front of them. So you'd you'd be able. Yeah, you'd get to a boat. There. That would be... Now, is the formation change two? Yeah, it's two pips because you're in terrain. Mm -hmm. Yep. So either way, it's going to be two pips. Yep. Pip, pip, cheerio. So if you had something else you wanted to do first... I'm, I'm not going to actually do... I'm not going to do anything on my side at this, uh, at okay. this stage. So okay, and that's fine. all of our stuff is for you. All right. Because I can also move, do something with Papancher's units back here in the back too. Some so. Mm -hmm. All right. We just want to make sure we we have the uh, we have at least enough to allow you to shoot. So. Yep. To do what you need to do. Well, if I move, this guy hasn't volleyed yet, so he could volley. I make the movement first. Down to three. Even if that first battalion ninety third line doesn't survive, whoever does is getting a medal. Because <laughs> volley volley's a is is a global army command, right? It's global, yeah. yeah. So what I'm thinking, if I take the volley now, mm -hmm. get these shots. Off of these guys, also. Yep. Including this lovely yeah. piece of artillery into this lovely square. Right. Right. Yes, that square <laughs> might not be there. Because if I do the formation change or the movement change, he's got a volley left to shoot with. So, I think I might yep. take my volley shot first and and work that. Very good, that sir. Angle. All right. As I say, fight your brigades. Yep. No, it's always good to talk these things through. So let's see. That's going to be uh, two for us, or is it mm -hmm. one? Just one. Just one. Okay. So we'll start all the way over here, just because I want to keep it in a sort of a swing. I'm going to go all the way to the left. I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody. How about them? They These uh, the, the rifles? rifles. Some of the rifles can anyway. Yeah, they. Can. Um. They. How about them? Nope. So, two. Uh, three you think shots? the rifle would get better range? <laughs> they, they get a better shot. That rifle is in range, so the th these three are. That's your rifles there. Yeah. Yep. Uh, so Still they are. five shots. Yeah. So it's uh, one, two, three. Yeah, exactly as you say. It's uh, five for four. It's five for threes. Yes. Because they are reflays. Two. Um, this one base, better. I think, would be shooting at. The one Brunswick could probably shoot them. I agree. That's one for four. Oh, actually. Oh, no, it's out of range. Maybe not. It's out of range, yeah. Because here you'd be shooting through your own guys. Yeah, nothing, 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 nothing. Here. Anybody in range? These Dutch? Uh, these oh, ones are, are in the forest. 
these guys these guys are fine here and that guy's are they in the woods or are they not in the woods they're not well this guy's in the woods this guy is not okay that's definitely a shot that's two right there two for four mike One. Oh dear. For what we are about to receive. <sighs> May the Lord make us truly thankful. Six for four. No, six for three. Yep. Okay, that could have yeah. been worse. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You want it, but if such things are measured. They're that's, not instantly going to die. Yeah, so that that one is. Mm. I think I does this two shots. Does infantry have a shot over this way? He's got to shoot here, that's man. Cool. Unless it's okay. yeah, it's that's to fine. your front. That's fine. Yep. So this is uh, one for four up here. Got it. Yep. And one for four on the right. Yes. All right. And then... this this guy here, but not the other guy. Uh, this guy here goes, and you could pick it either way, Mike. That's a fifty-fifty. Um, we'll just go straight ahead to the second battalion, ninety-third. Second battalion, ninety-third gets it. One for four. No. No. And then you this can dude, shoot this. This dude gets to shoot there. But that is a one shift down, I think. Yep. Mm-hmm. One for five. That's and that's it. it. All right, let's go all the way back to the beginning so we don't forget anything. There's a bunch Achilles. of stuff. There's some stuff. There's some hits. Achilles, two for four. Mm-hmm. Uh, five. The resolve is five. Plus. Oh, look at that. That's the Legere. Yeah, it's the Legere. That's the only thing the Legere get. Oh, wow. Cool. Wow. Okay, four for five. You can do this. <laughs> he's, in, he's feeling... That's pity. That's pity talk. Four for five, as the man says. Well, it's Mike that's rolling, so he can get this. One. One. That could have been a lot, 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 yeah, lot. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 especially. Oh, I was expecting roll. instant death for that square. Yeah, a fine red mist. Uh, one for four on those boys. No. One for four. Yes. Yeah. That'll do. Got him. Mm-hmm. That it? All right. That's a volley. French, uh, pay for that, please, if you haven't. And uh, French, you uh, get it back. So, uh, Dalinar, what would you like to do? I think we should just volley back. Okay. Um, do, do you have anything? Nope. Okay. Um, well, I've got... Do you want to start with my um, outer square here? Jim? Sure. Yeah, it's anywhere you want, really. Okay, so that, uh, I that get the one trading. shot at the rifles. Yeah, one for four. And then mm-hmm. with these cavalry, how many shots am I getting here? Well, this one's going to go there, and this one's going to go there. Okay. So that's one for four what? straight ahead. Uh, is that one shooting there or there? Uh, that one's going to shoot if he's in range, he's going to shoot there. So, so two, two at that guy. Yeah. Two hits. Wow. And same deal uh, over here. Two for four. One hit. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then I think I get a shot at them. Where? Th- them here? Yeah. Yeah, so that's going to be... They're, they're out of the trees, so that's one for four. Do you want me to combine everything or No. Let's just do it one at a time. It'll figure it out. Okay, so fine. Just the one for now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's a hit. No, this uh, gun. My... That's canister, I imagine. Yep. That's why it's there. Yeah. That's uh, eight. Ugh. Eight for three, because that's a heavy gun. No, it's eight for four, sorry. I get to re-roll something? I don't you know. Get to re- re- you get to re-roll one. Uh, there's, there's four hits anyway, so that's yeah. fine. 
Yeah, that seems like gilding the lily. Um, and then two for two for four. Nothing. And we scooch over here, and I think that's you can go both on that gun if you want. Uh, that's two, what's gonna happen. Two for four. Two hits. Nice. And, and then this one here is one for four. Nope. And this guy, yeah, he sees that. That's one uh, for five. One for five. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nope. All right. Let's rack them up from the back from the beginning. Sharp and Harper, one for five. <laughs> nope. Apparently, uh, Bostard missed him. Uh, over here, <laughs> two for five. The Duke of Brunswick. One hit. First one of these boys? It is. Uh, one for five over here to the left. Nope. And then uh, this one. This is a biggie. Uh, these are the uh, Nassau line. Oh, the Nassau line again. Five for four. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, oh my wow. God. Wow. That Nassau love. I don't even get it. Not even a little. Two for six on this gun. Nope. Nothing. Mm. That was mm. not as impressive as I thought it would be. Oof, oof, oof. All right. Hey, look, one. it started my, out that it, way. In my youth, they call that whiffing. Yeah, that, that, that <laughs> was a whiff. No doubt about it. That was indeed that's, a whiff. That's only one point for the French, which I assume they've paid over to yeah. the Allies. Bum, bum, we have bum. left. We have three, three left. Mm -hmm. And they're all yours, so. You too, LBW. Hey, Chrono. Hope you're doing well. All right. We're going to do some moving around with Papancher. All right. Inside the woods, he can move how far? Uh, you bit. can only move one and a half because you're uh, within four of me. Oh, that's yep. the yeah. That's more fundamental. Or sorry, one. It's one, not one and a half. I was thinking base width, uh, not base width, inches. Yeah. yeah. We're on grid. We're not on inches, and the bases yep. are larger than forty mils. <laughs> yeah, that's it. These well, guys are further oh. Boys, Was there's suddenly a gap. Slide to your right. Uh, <laughs> these guys can move the one and a half? No, no. Right. They get uh, six, I should think. Where's that four? Yeah. They're, they're, they're in mass, so yeah. Yeah, four. it's... it's yeah. There you go. That'll work. That's why we have reserves. No, in mass, you go six. Yeah, I was going to yeah. say, you got two more, Mike. Oh, okay. Once you go, yeah. If you, as long as you, as long as you say sideways, you're good. Yeah, and I'm just gonna go right up to the point of the four. So there, there you go. That'll work. Mm -hmm. I'm good with that. Uh, I think that's all I had for Poncher. All right, so that that's was two one, two points off and takes it over to the French. All right, Donner, do you want to move up or do you want me to charge the second NASA line in the flank? Yes. Okay. <laughs> um. Decisiveness. <laughs> oh dear. Well, that's all he can do, because we know that a huzzah, which he has used, he used his huzzah. He used it, guys. He used it. There it is. Uh, he's got a five. There, so but I am I am officially he is flanked though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's also down in difficult terrain. So you're five to four at jump. And that counts as poor formation. Poor formation. So instead of five to four, it is I rec or instead of No, because you're at a minus one. 
Sorry. I forgot my math all of a sudden. So I'm currently sitting at five. strength five. Yeah, you go so down I go to a four, terrain, right? and, he is and he's at a strength six, drops, going down to a five for terrain. But drops, yeah, So, it, but he also then drops to one. Yes. Because, because of the bad terrain, so it's four to one. Four. Nine. Bye. To wipe out. Um, I will. I will use my uh, secondary huzzah to take off that. Um, the the hurt I would get because I rolled a five. All right. You will not then to catch a disruption. You will not therefore have a marker which you couldn't use again anyway. I think that was fairly successful. I don't think you have any. Yeah, there's a. The uh, the first battalion, ninety third line, has set to wandering in the uh, Allied ranks. No dispute. That, however, does cost two points. How many does that leave the French with? That was that was our last two. That was that was it. All right, over to the Allies. It's all you know. What does attack column do again? That makes it so that that move you just did wasn't three points. Uh, melee costs an extra is a complication costing a point unless you're French unless you're French once again or Prus late war Prussians yeah yeah they got it allies you got a point I think we do what you what you want to do Mikey let's see I can't follow the other battalions that didn't shoot right sure you can yeah you yep. can okay even though they're in Papanchers yeah it, yeah, yeah, as long as they didn't shoot, it, it, yeah. So it'd just be that one base shooting once at me. I don't think that guy's anywhere near it, right? Is he? No, I'm yep. too far. Oh, one second. You'd be getting a single shot, Mike, by the look of it. Yeah, you might as well just take the single shot. Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to do uh, formation change and put these guys into line? He can't. Yeah. Uh. Oh, you can't. You've only got one point. Uh, that's right. It would take two. On it. Uh, it's a shame these guys had to move to get there because if they charged from there, it would be a flank. Yep. But, oh, well. Say la vie. But that, to the point we were making earlier, is three points. Indeed. Or do you want to move Alton up? Oh, I rolled. Oh, he's made Sorry. it. All right, that uh, we good. already we already moved Alton at the beginning of the turn, and unfortunately, that's a miss. Oh yeah. So, all right, that's it. Yeah, remember we we used a point early on to make sure we can get him onto the field and move him up. Yeah, you're right. Taking the chance of running out of pips and forgetting about him. Yeah, this is this is feeling <laughs> right. This is feeling kind of exciting. I'm kind of curious to see what's going to happen all the way over here, and the fight, yeah, the fight in the woods is a little nuts. Um, I can't believe that worked, honestly. Which one? Yeah, neither can I. The, the anything. I'm surprised the 93rd line exists. <laughs> well, that's 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 a whole thing by itself. Let me get a picture. I, yeah, I love. I think this is where LaSalle lives. It's in the singles. It's this. I'm not a fan of the LaSalle club games on TTS. They could work very very well. I think uh, live. But these big scenarios where everybody's playing at the same time and everybody just grabs a little bit and moves it, um, these are a lot of fun. These are these are really, really good. And I think this is having... Thank you uh, again, Destruct, for coming in and uh, coming Welcome. in in late relief. Um, Happy to be here, as always. Yeah. QB, this is going to be turn three when we start. It's a, uh, we obviously had to spend a lot of time getting set up and all that stuff, so I don't worry about that too much. But we have been saved, so what's going on? Saturday is Crossfire. Uh, Saturday is a Normandy 1944 game, and we're going to, everyone who joins, gets an extra bonus token to mock Achilles. Nice. <laughs> Damn it, I'm going to miss that. That sucks. Because, because Not Ach me. Achilles... <laughs> Because Achilles is a tanker by training and profession, has wanted <laughs> tanks in Crossfire, and the one time we add tanks to our Crossfire mix, he's not there. I know. So breaking uh, my heart. 
excuse me, our guy Michael Hopper has built us a scenario. He is also, because he's good, he has sent me a shack, a brand new Shaco scenario for Borodino Week. Ooh. Nice, huh? So yeah. we will uh, have some Shaco battle. It'll be Utitsa, uh, but this time done by Michael, so i got to really dig in and get that done right. We've got this next Thursday, and as I say, on Saturday... We've Saturday Night Fights. We've got Crossfire with tanks. So all kinds of gaming. Um, and, you know, we don't talk about it much anymore just because we do have so many games and so many people playing them. Um, but as I said to LBW, if the question comes up, we recruit over at armchairdragoons.com over in the forums. Uh, that's how Ron made his way in. That's how Achilles made his way in. That's, you know, so... Not, yeah, years, what three years now? Yeah, yeah, it's been a minute, but it's how recruitment folks get is in. a polite way to put it. Yeah, it's dragooned, pressed. You choose it, <laughs> but yeah, that's 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 how we do it. So if you're interested, come on over and talk about it. You know, games differ week to week, so um, who knows? Maybe there'll be something you like. Anyway, thanks to the players, thanks to the viewers. You know, we appreciate you. Until we meet again, please take care of yourselves and one another. We'll talk soon. Pause. Pause.